Okay, time for this week MLP Vlog, and first of all, yep, that poster is gone. I'm gonna get rid of it regardless of how that movie because it's not gonna kick me in a poster anyway. So there you go. If you remember my review, I fought Crossfire. Okay. There. <laughs> I have a review, and I can only get it up to do this video, so. Again, I wanted to put a new poster there, but I couldn't find anything good. But, what can I do? I'm coming up new and going there. Um, oh, maybe I'll come next week, I don't know. Anyway, so, oh boy, um, this episode on Red One Reaction. Fishing of this episode, I'll get, to, I don't want to say the title that came right after that, right on yesterday. And this episode, this is well, the first time I watched it, I'm going immediately after I woke up because when I, I woke up, I was like, when I woke up, I went to over here. I think I went when full up in the living room. I don't know why, it felt like it. It's an incontent to watch a pony come like, oh shit, you know, I'm like, and you, and I don't usually do what I think up anyway, but I totally forgot about doing it, and I figured I was there, my ball well watching, so, even before I went to check internet stuff for the first time today, I went and watched the episode, so I started to only get, went onto the internet and got one person reaction and another person <laughs> which, based on the cut code, I'm definitely think with that person reaction, so, Can you close the door for me? My door? Anyway, the episode in 28 Pranks Later. Story by Megan McCarthy, written by FM DeMarco. Yes, the same FM DeMarco from Little Petra. We've seen LP writers go on to LPS all the time, but today we have a reverse. With LPS over, I could probably only fitting. I did, they announced for me on Twitter, like, you won't buy, I didn't hear it, so I didn't know who it was until, I don't like when they announced it, because I don't like getting spoilers, but, there you go, um, yeah, no story by one, so, in this episode, the big just in that maybe I should getting particularly prank happy again, no team, you know, you know, pretty cool, you know, a lot of people, and, you know, and at the start of the episode, she prank, she prank, like, flush on it for a harsh way, and they all call out on it, particularly because it's too easy to do. But then Rain would actually be like, oh yeah, I'll show you Iggy to get a challenge, which is kind of all for kind of breaking in a different way. So we just go around breaking all people and they all get pretty sick of it. And then, you know, then at one point Rain would actually to do a more epic prank in which she switch and all the discount girl scout cookies, which are going to go to everyone. We have cookies that give them rainbow mouth. Back our big lover plan. But she couldn't find out about cooking much maintains in the company because like every pony turning into a zombie and stuff. Ooh, and a prank and backfired. Well, the first thing that's got because that had a twist that was blatantly spoiled by the official description of the episode. Like every description I've read of the episode from the TV I think got to it and such spoiled the ending, which was probably meant to be some kind of twist in the episode. Way to go. So and from Okay, I, I thought, thinking, I don't know if I'm gonna spoil it or not. Well, I kind of have to because I have to cook. When it comes to get cooked, but not a whole lot to it. It's all pranking, yeah. Get the getting, you get kind of gushing, pranking, and the gushing. Everything all about the prank element, but no other element. Not comedy, but not, you know, an acting comedy. Most of it comes from the pranking and people talking about it. So it's not, so you can only talk about the prank stuff and how the character acts. In that regard, and there's not much to really comment on. There's not much to it. So it's all about the pranking stuff. And honestly, if I couldn't talk about the ending, I couldn't. I would be, be able to tell what I'm talking about just from the way I talk about it. So, screw it. Um, should I have a point of tank? No, because that's what they get for spoiling it. It's not the writer's fault, not Mr. DeMarco's fault, but it's, you know, whatever people's fault for spoiling it in the description. Making the whole guy thing with a big prank to get back at Rainbow Dash. So, in other words, this episode is Mysterious Marywell meets the Fostering Halloween episode. Right down to the fact that we were both over a prank. Clark is here, is looking done better than that one, I think. Because, you know, we're going to over a tick. It goes down prank, but not dumb as the stuff Blue did. And again, they didn't basically get angry at something that was technically their fault because they pulled that prank. But, <laughs> nah, because it's an episode. Um, and how to compare, and compare all like about them doing something on Rainbow Dash and it was very kind of better than that one because um, they have a better Regan because she is doing something a lot stupider and bitchier and you know, all that. You know, um, 
know, go for warranted, but we don't. When I read the description, I thought we could improve upon that one in the can that we need to get ski in the front pocket this time. Um, you know, how we do it and how we feel about doing the skin. Then we get more of the game problem with that because, and, you know, and I'm just gonna carry right now, but I feel like I'm gonna debate it. I am not sure how to feel about this one. Because, more because, yeah, the prank, on one hand, the prank they pour is fairly cool, but at the same time, it's to show her that they can teach Rainbow Nash that some things, Rainbow Nash is not going to think that everyone finds it funny when not everyone finds it funny, and she will work quite to have a horrible effect on you when you do not perfectly find it all bad. Amusing. And again, in the mole here, it gets like too bad, even though it's another one that could have happened earlier. And again, maybe not again. So I think I'm too real with that kind of thing, but anyway. Yeah, um, you know, and they do have any motivation to an extent. You yeah. know, they have a reading it for being a harsh thing. It is, again, it's not the only thing it's the worst, but it may not just think we're probably maybe that's fault, which is pretty scary. Like, go, I don't know. On one hand, pretty harsh strength, but on the other hand, better reading and, you know, and all that. And, Rob, this one just kind of mixed, because, you know, Rainbow Dash, yeah, she got it kind of, but she's not being too considerate, it's going to be pulling a lot of pranks. But at the same time, she, she does cast some showers in some way to top herself in places. And she is kind of lightning sometimes, you know, sometimes she just get like this and go be, you know, fine. You know, let's take it up a lot of it, she felt kind of bored. You know, it's like, you know, her butt, trying to back a little bit too cool. She pulls pranks. But on her occasionally, but the next one it felt like it going not going too far, but particularly bad. And I really keep trying to go back and easy one to do it with. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and I feel like old it comes from one so much around the brain thing that if you do not buy room with that or think she being bitch you know, okay if you don't buy a lot of major motivations and gotta really fall apart because it's not I mean, you know, it's like if you because if you're into fish, then, you know, and I guess you think you're playing a holy one, and you, you know, and I'm not going too much of Mary Well because that's a different can of worms, and I've gone over that one so much that if I do quite real on that one, that's going to be funny. I saw that one so whole much, and especially when I did my 2013 rewatch better on the blog, where I went to more detail on the episode true failures and stuff like that, and looking at the pattern of that one, you know, you know, in terms of that cover, some way you could argue that one dog get better, but some way worse. I don't know. I bet I don't watch that one again to pay a lot more attention. So I don't know last time I watched that one. Well, <laughs> I know it's something I'm using for that video, though. <laughs> I don't know if I ever do it, but um, but yeah, a lot of it people, you know, pranking and in some way, random dash, you know, get to be kind of bitching going overboard for so that. You're kind of just trying to do a prank on her. And some people might think that Rainbow Nash behavior is just going to make a lot of guys and love to completely character. Yeah, the prank porn, it can watch better. Of course, everyone's just kind of being terribly dumb. Or you might think everything fully checked out and, you know, teaching a good lesson about it. The pranking and everything can kind of make sense. And the end of the the amusing joke to bounce me out of it. Some people like, some people like reaction is kind of amusing, you know. Especially early on, and it's kind of fun for them to do a full on gobby thing. You know, I'd love for them to do a real gobby thing, but now they can't because they put it on the episode. Right. But, you know, kind of. You can to do fun here and turn into gobby and all that. So, yeah, debatable. Like, honestly, there is a description I wasn't quite sure about before, but I figured, hey, maybe we'll give their point of view and we'll give them a little of it. At the moment, I can't tell which one I like. But, uh, I guess with one that better motivation for the character what we're doing, so, okay. Okay. Kind of interesting, the film in the I, I knew, I knew his style, but then he just started doing that video mode, like, up against the musical. Which was definitely unlike him, uh, go out with a half a land. Um, and this one definitely corporate his style, but, um, yeah, he, he can't do a goal mod in the game, so he'll go out of time. But that because have one, but the one does it. Go. I could pick up here for it because I feel like if I've been compromised, I'm going to go coffee after all. Um, <laughs> so, there you go. Um, um, you know, okay, I'm 
reaction coin should be fun because you know um you know, I'm asking people going, oh, everything completely online, you're out of time, whatever, to be people going, everybody can't fun up and go, yeah, whatever. I know one guy like it, but he can guide him, like, really, like, yeah, <laughs> aka, you know, I don't, and, you know, but, you know, he's cool. He's awesome. <laughs> he fucked me on the internet anyway, he probably would have watched it. Um, well, he would, no, right. Um, Gobert 28 prank player. Love the title, by the way. Not really trying to feel about it because I'm coming full out of justified and coming pretty good thing. Well, call it not justified and just people being terribly Trevor. So, I'm going to rate the point debatable. And I feel like when I watch it again, knowing a lot of what happened, I think I'll probably be clearer on it. Because anyone's going to kind of rage and not like the point from the way kind of things get up, but then kind of things going on, I'm like, ooh, never mind. And I watch it again being more fair, I'll probably be more fair to it. I like what they're attempting to do in some way, but I feel like the execution and timing could have been better in some way. So, most of them feel well meaning, even a lot of people who don't like their well meaning in some way. Even if they come across and like yicky, there's a good meaning behind it. Well, I can look so they quite a teeny bit. We're going to limit, of course, but, you know. I mean, it won't get to a point where Petra didn't work too bad at because we're ready to almost go again. You know, a lot of stuff, but, you know. So. Yeah, kind of mixed bag enough. So two in a row, I couldn't call flat out good. I'm kind of feeling okay, but I won't go far and call it flat out good. It was alright. You know, but, you know, the cup code will go mixed bag into Fury, so... It's weird. You're going to have them twice in a row. But, you know, they had their high points, though, so I'm not going to say anything. But, anyway, um... I couldn't say more, but the only question can say I'm pretty simplistic when you get my down to it. You know? I think I've almost been too snorted very well in some way, because I feel like, uh, really ashy, but, you know, if it doesn't quite better, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, I kind of shouldn't leave when Pinkie Pie, like, pranked again, way back with a brush on shoot. Did she get to get one of that before we got involved, or get the other way around? Um, I can't remember, so. But, yeah. Uh, kind of a mixed bag, like, go back, hack up a moment, hack a bow. No, not a great new fair friend of Marco, but hey, I hope more of people when I come to the show, because we well, got going on. <laughs> so, there you go. Next week, and I don't know if I'm kind of hoping I'm coughing on like a time, the time they are changeling. Yep, yeah, a changeling type of go, oh boy. The prank count interesting, if cliche, go. A lot of people look forward to that one, go. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, that one good. Going two in a row, and not think I'm were bad or even mediocre. They're just, you know, not good. It's just because not, not good, like, I mean, it can't be, you know, we're flying, you know, we're not going to go like that. Oh, wait till, wait till Monday. Um, Monday, and, um, uh, well, that week, and Monday, we'll clock be live for boom, to boom, turn. Um, go. That could be a fun one to do. I'm going to go. Yeah. Um, yeah, I. And I don't know, again, I don't know anything I'm going to be able to do, but random, because from my no plan to do until I watch the pod. But I want to do one that you feel fine, but we've got a lot I could really hit about it. Go. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but hey, we'll see a couple things like tickle my pickle. Oh, there we go. So, um, like a bug kit for 20 plates later. Uh, 28th prank later. <laughs> More like several bad puns later. <laughs> Might catch it a quick bit. Well, well, um, so, yeah, I shall see you for both Buttering and Time They Are Changeling and whatever. So, uh, bye.